Issues surrounding the effects of lightning and survival methods during a lightning strike can be bewildering for the average person. It's bewildering due to the various tales and assumptions that, over time, have been debunked, ranging from metal piercings attracting lightning to the potential harm if one is indoors during a lightning strike. We've even countered the claim that glass formation is always a byproduct of lightning striking sand. The latest claim to look into is, a car acts as a fortress against a lightning strike due to its rubber tires. However, we have to burst this bubble. There's no ultimate safety inside a car during a lightning strike, despite the rubber tires. Now, while rubber is renowned for its insulating properties, the inability to allow electricity to traverse it, rubber doesn't necessarily offer you an impenetrable defense against a lightning strike, which is essentially a massive electric current zapping down from the sky. Simply put, the insulating capacity of rubber cannot reliably stand up against a force this powerful. Consider this. A lightning bolt is extremely rich in electric current and can heat up the air along its path by thousands of degrees. It also cuts through several thousands of feet of air independently before making its way to your car. This air provides a substantial amount of electrical resistance. The cumulative resistance of these many layers of the atmosphere is vastly greater than the insulation provided by the few inches of rubber on your car's tires. Imagine, if a lightning bolt is able to bore through kilometers of atmospheric resistance, do you truly believe a few inches of rubber could suddenly halt its course? Nonetheless, don't start panicking at the thought of ever again taking a car ride during an electrical storm. Automobiles regularly get struck by lightning, and often their passengers survive unscathed. There is protection provided, However, it's not courtesy of the car's tires, but rather from its metallic frame. When a vehicle incorporated with a metallic structure is hit by lightning, the current predominantly flows around the car's outside and spills into the ground underneath, a process known as earthing. Essentially, your car transforms into something like a Faraday cage. A Faraday cage, or Faraday shield, is a conductive encasement or conductive mesh that can block external electrostatic and electromagnetic effects. Upon receiving a tremendous electrical spark, it channels the electricity, transferring it to the ground. This leaves the Faraday cage's inhabitant unharmed by the powerful electric current. Your car is essentially a mobile Faraday cage. However, a substandard metallic composition of your car's body can compromise its Faraday cage attribute and enhance danger levels. Furthermore, convertible vehicles lack metallic roofs posing yet another significant threat. There isn't a magical method to offer 100% safety from lightning, but rest assured, not everyone gets killed when struck by lightning. In fact, there are several recorded miraculous escapes when humans were seemingly doomed due to lightning strikes. The most favorable strategy against lightning strikes is simple. Stay indoors, exercise caution, and hope you're not strolling through a cornfield during a thunderstorm.